What's up you guys, it's Nate with IGM Auto and today I am so excited to be standing next to this 1978 Lincoln Continental Mark V Diamond Jubilee Edition which was originally made to commemorate Ford Motor Company's 75th anniversary as part of their designer editions. This car is loaded with nostalgic features but what makes it even better is it has a really cool story to tell. So let's dive into it and take a look. First thing you'll notice on this car is the color. It has this shimmering gold paint known by Ford as Jubilee Gold, where only 2,557 of them were made. Along with this, you have all this unique custom badging throughout. The front hood emblem with the Lincoln logo it has actual gold inside of it. You have embossed Lincoln logos on the headlights. You have J Diamond Jubilee Edition badging on the opera windows in the back and tons of different unique two-tone pinstriping across that really ties this car together and gives it that unique nostalgic feel to it. Now, let's talk about the powertrain. Back in 78, Lincoln had two options available for this model. One was a 6.6 liter V8, and the other was a 7.5 liter V8, which is what this car has. Now, what's unique about this car is, outside of the battery, it's really all original straight from the factory. Along with this, it's paired with a three-speed automatic transmission that ultimately puts out 210 horsepower with 357 pound-feet of torque. While that may not seem like a lot, it actually ties together perfectly to make this a great cruising vehicle. The minute you open the door to this 78 Lincoln Continental Mark V, you're instantly transported in time to experience what luxury was like in the late 70s. What sets this car apart is that the interior is all original and all in immaculate condition. Along with all these plush, luxurious comforts, the car really is not lacking when it comes to amenities that you'd find in modern day cars. There's air conditioning, power mirrors, and heated side view mirrors, so if you're out in the cold, they'll defrost for you. There's cruise control, a CB radio, and a push button FM AM radio, a quadrasonic cassette tape player, power seats, that both tilt and slide, and of course, a Cartier clock to match the Diamond Jubilee Edition, and a CB radio. Now, let's take it for a test drive and experience how this car really feels. Being Ford's longest wheelbase in a coupe ever, you would expect this to be an extremely smooth ride, and that is exactly what it is. I really cannot express how smooth this car is going down the street. We're going over some brick road, some just slight hills, and it really is smooth. It feels like you're floating on a cloud. Compared to other maybe sportier coupes made in the 70s, this car does lack a bit on power, but it makes up for it in luxury, comfort, it's quiet, it's smooth, and it's, it's honestly just super fun to drive just as it is. Um, you totally feel the luxury that comes off of it and it's kind of fun to put yourself in the shoes of what somebody would be driving home from the dealership with this when they first got it. Now, what really sets this car apart though is the story. Back 45 years ago, it was originally delivered to the original owner back in Spokane where the local community press did an article on it where they shot photos and everything to let the community know that, hey, this car has arrived. It was the first one to hit in Spokane and you can really feel what the buzz was about because of how cool this car is. While this car was originally delivered 45 years ago, it has only had three owners over its lifetime with the original owner holding on to it for over 40 years. Along with that, the car is really only sitting at 28,000 miles and it's all original both inside and out. Really, outside of tires and batteries, it's completely stock and not just stock, but stock in immaculate condition. You can tell that it was always garage kept and well maintained because of the condition of the interior. Normally, we see a lot of, you know, sun stain and just dust and wear and tear on old cars back from the 70s, but all the wood grain on this, all the leather wrapped dashboard and seats, they're all in truly immaculate condition. The buttons, the finishes on the turn signals, and nothing's worn out. It's all extremely well kept and really just adds to that feel as you're driving down the road and helps, I mean, I guess justify why everybody's looking at you everywhere you go. Thank you guys for following along today. And I know you're all probably wondering, where can I get one of these? How much will it cost me? And how soon can I get my hands on it? This 78 is actually for sale as well, and you can find the link below in the description. So make sure to go check that out, and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe.